I'm A14 Projects, and this is the Occidental Leather DIY Toll Belt Setup Continued. I forgot to mention in my previous video that this right side toll bag, the Occidental Leather 8018DB, has a leather hammer holder, or a leather hammer loop. And according to Scott Wadsworth, also known as the Essential Craftsman, he claims that these wear out really quickly, and I have no plans on using it. What I will use for now, until I can get an Occidental Leather metal hammer loop, is this CLC 439 hammer holder. And I also wanted to talk about the hammers that I use primarily for DIY remodeling work. Uh, I think the best overall and the most versatile hammer is the S-Wing E316S. It's a short-handled smooth face hammer with a rip claw and I think if you're just going to own one hammer that's probably the one to own because uh, you'll never have to replace the handle and basically they're from all accounts they're indestructible. I also have a a framing hammer from S-Wing. This is the E6-15SM and this is a longer handle. It has a milled face and it also has a side nail puller with the rip claw. Now, I want to warn everyone that this side nail puller does not work nearly as well as what I've seen from the uh, Stiletto T-Bone and the uh, Martinez M1 and M4. It, it lacks in uh, nail pulling for sure. So beware of that if you go to purchase this. And I think they refer to this as the Estwing Ultra framing hammer. So check those out if you uh, get a chance. Please subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thank you very much.